And over to everybody's favorite romantic city on the water. It's quite literary, literally party time in Venice as the city's famed two-week-long carnival has gotten underway. Waterborne fantasy creatures and vessels of all types took over Venice's waterways to mark the opening of the Lagoon City's annual carnival on Saturday evening. A nighttime spectacle and a stylish start to one of the world's oldest carnivals. Welcome to the 2015 edition of the Venice Carnival. Titled the most delicious feast in the world, food and poetry are serving as inspiration for the giant structures and objects floating in and flying over the Canareggio Canal. Tourists from many different countries gather along the banks and on the bridges of the canal to watch the spectacle. People are crazy, but it's very perfect and beautiful and wonderful. I think, yeah. Yeah. Oh, but uh, it's, it's a little different, but uh, Venice is is unique. So I it's a dream to stay here to celebrate this this event. This is my third time. I'm in Venice, and I just wanna see that how is the different during the carnival. The costumes are re really uh, fascinated, you know. Venice resident Lorenzo Macanigo said the city itself was what made the carnival so special. First of all, the city is like no other in the world. Then there are the masks and all the other beautiful things that people can see here. Bars in Venetian palaces, concerts and gondola parades are organized throughout the 17-day carnival, which runs until February the 17th. Thousands of tourists from across Italy and the world crowd the city's canals, bridges, and squares every year to marvel at the colorful display of masks and costumes. Carnival madness first began centuries ago as a period of excess before rigors of Lent, the 40 days of fasting that traditionally precede Easter. Venetians could then hide their identities behind masks and do as they pleased. It was a pressure valve to ease class tensions, allowing the poor for a brief and controlled period to break Venice's rigid oligarchical social order. The carnival's end marks the beginning of Lent and signals the start of Venice's tourist season, which runs into the autumn. Song Yaotian, CCTV.